there's children of Armenia whom are of you. It's been more than a month now that the Armenian Apostolic Church's different committees and groups, with cooperation with social and employment ministries, are accepting the refugees from Artsakh, providing shelter and food and all other necessities required. The Arabkir Armenian Children's Home is now accepting many who have lost their homes and possessions in Artsakh. For more than a month, the Arabkir Armenian Children's Home is serving the Armenians from Artsakh and distributing life necessities to all areas as well as Yerevan. This has been a fruitful exercise between the church and our government's successful cooperation. As you are aware, our Catholicos, through structure of our church, has provided essential assistance to our countrymen from Artsakh. 500 refugees have been provided shelter and other necessities by our church. Special attention is given to the children that have lost their homes and possessions because of the war and the Azeri aggression. Besides life necessities, the children need moral and psychological support. Mrs. Nelly Galustian is working with the children and she is a child care psychologist. She expressed her concern that many of the children needed psychological support. We are trying to eliminate the psychological pain that some of the children endured. We never talk or remind them of the war. We have had an exhibition of drawings and paintings by the children produced by them. We try to have a jolly time with the children, painting, drawing and playing games. We are from Shushi. We were at Shushi when the war broke and our mother sent me and my sister to Yerevan. Then on the 29th of September when the war took a more dangerous turn, my mother and our aunt joined us. I came to Yerevan before the war broke out. I came to Yerevan on the 26th of September for a competition. Then I called my mother to tell her that I had won. Then my mother told me that the Azeris have attacked us and the war has started. The social assistance centre is accepting hundreds of refugees and in a short time they provided them with government accommodation. Until they are accommodated, they are provided with food, medicine and other social assistances. Most of the time the immediate action is to provide shelter, food, medical assistance and in some cases psychological assistance. We have specialist social workers that assist refugees case by case to fulfil their requirements. At the centre, there are many individuals that are specialists in different professions whose services are provided by the ministry as well as volunteers.